Welcome, Virgos. I'm back. What's good? What's good, guys? Happy to be here with y'all. Don't forget to click that like button on y'all way in, all right? Because I just got a feeling that Virgos reading is about to be real, real interesting. Y'all hit the like button, okay? Don't forget to share with your family and your friends. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that bell to subscribe, okay? I want to let you know that this is the final day, guys, for my special. Um, no, we actually, I think we have 31 days, okay? So until March the 31st, that is going to be the last day of my sale that I'm running, okay? You can book your personal readings now for the discounted rate of $44.44. Originally priced at $67. I'm doing this to the end of the month. I've been doing this in, <laughs> I've been giving this sale out for the entire month of March, okay? All the way up until the last day, all right, to the 31st. My reads will be $44.44, okay? You get one question, and you get a free bonus question, okay? The only catch with the bonus question is it has to be a yes or no question because I am going to utilize my pendulum to answer the question, okay? So with that being said, if you want to book, my contact information is going to be in the drop box, all right? So... Let's see what's going on. Give me a, um, I need to get an overall energy for my Virgos. What, what is coming towards Virgos? Virgos, this is a timeless reading, okay? Whenever you're meant to see it is when you're meant to see it. But this is going, I'm going to direct it from now going until, going into April, okay? Some of you are afraid to take action on something or you're thinking about a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or you're thinking about taking some type of action, okay? I'm here to shuffle uh, four times. Okay. Give me an overall message for Virgos, please. Give me an overall message for this reading. We got the judgment. The judgment. All right, so there's this big awakening, all right? There is a second chance on the table as well, okay? I see you got money on your mind. Money on your mind. I see it. I see you. I see you thinking about your bag. All right, give me, why is the judgment card here? This is a final decision as well. Okay. Okay, I'm sensing that there is communication getting ready to come in, okay? Communication is getting ready to come in. I'm getting, um, some of you could be dealing with the fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I got Aquarius here too. What is the Eight of Wands here? What is the Eight of Wands here? Ooh. Okay, Four of Pentacles. Some of you guys have been holding back. Holding this back. There's something that you've been wanting to say. And I feel like you're getting ready to finally say it, Okay. There's something here. Somebody's crying over spilled milk. We got Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, okay? Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Huh. Huh. What's going on? What's going on? Let's see what's going on. Past energy. Give me past energy. The lovers in the reverse. You could be dealing with a Gemini, okay? Or there was just some type of bad decision in love, okay? Presently, we got the two of pentacles. You juggling. What's the future energy? Give me future energy for Virgos, please. Woo! See, look, we got regrets here. We got the five of cups. Seven of swords. Okay. There's somebody. Is somebody creeping out? Is somebody creeping? Creeping. Is somebody creeping on the low, on the low, low? <laughs> somebody sneaking out, okay? Because we got the Seven of Swords and the Reverse and the Ten of Cups. Nine of Cups. 
Somebody want to sneak off, okay? Um, somebody got a decision between two people, too. Somebody's juggling two people. Maybe you feel like, you know, I don't want to regret. I don't want to, you know, make a mistake. I don't want to regret this. But let's see what's going on here. Why is the lovers here in the reverse? See, look, the two of cups. Some of y'all, look, your energy here at the bottom of the deck. And the Ace of Swords in the reverse. So the whole truth did wasn't out, okay? In the past, there was a little bit of the story out, okay? Just a little bit, but not everything, okay? I'm getting real big energy from Aries. Aries energy, okay? Could be a Leo or a Sagittarius as well. Some of you guys are dealing with the fire sign. I'm picking up on Gemini as well as Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Okay? But there's definitely wise of two of cups here. And maybe you had to decide on whether or not you was going to be in a relationship. Why is the two of cups here? Yeah, the devil in the reverse. Okay. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Capricorn. But maybe you want more invested, okay? The seven of pentacles here is in the reverse, okay? Maybe you've been losing a little bit of patience. And you feel like something was unjust, too. For some of you, this is a divorce. Someone is talking, you know, divorce talk. Or someone here is, you know, talking about they want to split. And it just made matters worse, okay? It just made matters worse. Someone here is very possessive or very needy, okay? Very clingy. Lots of three of wands here. Lots of waiting energy. Yeah, waiting on somebody to make up their mind if they want to be in a relationship. Do they want this or do they not want this? Do you want this or you don't? Because if you don't, I got other things to do, okay? You're not going to be clinging on to me, hanging on to me. And thinking that you could just do what you want to do. No, we're not going to do that. Do you want to be together or not? <laughs> Somebody's tired of putting in all this work for nothing. Two of Pentacles. Present energy right now is the Two of Pentacles. So somebody's juggling, okay? Somebody got a lot going on. There we go again, Two of Swords. Somebody most definitely feel mentally conflicted, okay? I'm not sure if you want to leave. Mine's the Eight of Cups here. Yep, Hermit. You're not sure what to do right now. You don't know. You don't know how to deal with it. You don't know, really know what to do. You're feeling conflicted, confused. It's just a lot to think about. It's mind-boggling right now. Or oh, whether or not if you want to leave. This could definitely be someone that you've been dealing with for a while. Could be someone from your past that returned during this retrograde. Okay. Now you're waiting like to make up your mind. You need to like make up your mind. Five of Cups. There's regrets here in the future. Okay. Why is the Five of Cups here? Yep. You're going to regret going back. Six of Cups. Six of Cups. Why is the Six of Cups here? You regret giving this person a second chance? Why the Six of Cups? Yep, Four of Pentacles. Okay. You may be feeling like you've been holding on. Or you've been, you know, just... You've been holding back. Why the Four of Pentacles here? Three of Pentacles. Maybe you feel like you could have uh, kept doing what you had going on. There's lots of threes here. There could definitely be a third party involved in the situation. I'm sensing like we got the chariot card here. Cancer's energy. Is someone working on a vehicle or working on a car? Why is the chariot card here? Four of cups. There's disappointments. There's disappointing news coming up, okay? But someone's afraid to say it. Someone's afraid to ask or something about something here. Why is the four of cups here? Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody is a little brat. You guys might be being a little bratty. All right? Y'all might be being a little bratty with the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay? You may be feeling like finances aren't where you want them to be or how you want them to be. Okay? 
You may not feel secure or stable. And it disappoints you. Okay? So this is like a repeat. For some of you guys, this is a repeat. Because we got the regrets and the six of cups. This is like an ongoing thing. I'm getting that that it could be an ongoing thing too with the two of pentacles and the two of swords. Okay? You don't want to have to repeat this. Okay? You don't want to have to keep going through this. Where's the hermit here? Yeah, see, look, you're not trying to be stressed out with this nine of swords, okay? You're not trying to be stressed out about this at all. You're not trying to be worried. Worried about what this person doing, worried about what it is. Some of y'all is like wanting wanting to give up on, on this situation, okay, and just leave. This could be work-related as well, too, for some of you. This, this doesn't have to be... Love, okay. I see some stability here too. All right. Maybe some of you are worried about stability. What's the four of wands here? There could be a marriage here. Yeah, there's a marriage here. For some of you guys, there's a marriage here, okay? That is so freaking burdensome. Yeah, this burdensome. Ooh. Some of you guys, it's a Capricorn here. But somebody just, just drags their feet, okay? And it pisses you off. It's making you mad. We got the Empress. She's in the reverse. The King of Pentacles in the reverse. This could be like a mother, a baby mother, a baby father, something in, the, in that nature. But there's instability here. There's, there's unstableness here. We got the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse and the King of Pentacles in the reverse, okay? So, I mean, there's there needs to be some type of balance here, okay? I'm getting a lot of mental uh, anxiety type of energy surrounded around a relationship on whether or not this is going to work or not, okay? Let's see what let's let's get some advice. Okay, let's go to advice. What messages do we have for my Virgos? What message is there for my Virgos, please? Okay, we got birthing a new age. Birthing new creations, dreaming a new world into being, okay? And then we got just say yes. We got yes at the bottom of the deck, okay? I'm sensing as well that some of you guys just need to have fun. Don't take things too serious. I'm sorry if you guys hear a lot of screaming in the background, but that's my neighbor. Her kids are outside. Okay, so give me two more cards for Virgo. The initiation, rite of passage, crossing the threshold. You got to trust your path, okay? If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? If you knew you had the support, what would you do? Would you move differently if you knew you had the support? Okay, warrior woman, look. You guys are warriors, okay? Whatever you're dealing with, whatever you're going through, you're going to get through it. You have to carry that queen of wands energy. All right, have you answered your deepest calling? How are you being called to step up and lead? Okay? And also know that you are not alone. Ancient ancestors stand beside you. Okay? So you're not in it alone. Let's see what the angels have to say. All right. What message do you have for my Virgos? The situation is going to improve, okay? The situation is going to improve. It is going to improve. No need to worry, okay? No need to worry. It's going to improve, okay? Things are going to get better. The situation is getting ready to improve, okay? I also got reconsider. There's something here that needs to be reconsidered. Give me one more card. There's something better, okay? I'm sensing that there needs to be some compromise. Somebody needs to compromise with someone here, okay? And until there is a balance or some type of compromise on how things are going to be done, 
the things could just possibly kind of be like all over the place, all right? So I'm going to get some clarifiers because I got a few cards that I do want to clarify. I'm going to clarify all of them as a matter of fact. All right, so we got the situation will improve. Let's see what we got here. Please give me a clarifier for, well, goodness gracious, look at that. And it is going to improve. You got to have faith, okay? You got to have faith. You got the star card. That is things healing, all right? And then we got you at the bottom of the deck, the eight of cups. Okay, some of you guys are walking away from a marriage. I see that most clearly, like walking away from a marriage. Some of you are, are walking away. We got no here. Why is no here? Six of cups. Okay, when you look back, look, don't go back. The world, and it's upright. This is closing that chapter, okay? Closing that chapter. Whatever this is, for some of you, this is a job. This is dealing with a love, you know, a lover. Something here about the past needs this, a certain cycle needs to be closed, okay? A certain cycle needs to be closed. But just know that there's definitely no need to worry here. Why is no need to worry here? Why is no need to worry here? Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, I'm getting like there's two people that you may have in your corner, okay? Why is the Queen of Cups here? And maybe, you know, take care of your, yourself emotionally, okay? Emotionally. Make sure that you're emotionally um, and mentally, you know, stable, okay? Because I got the two of swords here. So this is like, you know, making sure that you're emotionally stable, okay? Reconsider. Why is reconsider here? Two of cups. Reconsider this relationship, okay? Why is the two of cups here? King of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody might not be fully prepared, stable, financially stable, or just, you know, aren't fully together yet, okay? There's something about this relationship that needs to be reconsidered. Then we got there's something better, okay? Yep, Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. Give me a clarifier for Eight of Pentacles. Try something new. Try something new. Try something new. Change it up. Yep. Change it up. It's time to change it up. It's time for a shift. Try something new. A old way of thinking or doing something is outdated. And it's time to try something new. Okay. It's time to try something new, Virgos. Y'all need something new. All right. If this reader resonated with you guys, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up. Let me know what's going on in the comment section while y'all in quarantine. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, all right? If you want to book your very own personal reading, that information is in the drop box. And I'll chat with y'all later. Ciao, y'all. If I figure out how to get this, how to stop this video. <laughs> Bye, y'all.